I've always loved to create. I've always loved to take something from nothing and see the beauty that arrives. I was very interested in the period styles and the different styles of furniture and how it all started and where it came from and what style things were and how it all transformed. So I think it started out with an interest in furniture. When choosing a designer, you need to feel comfortable with them and feel like you can trust them. You're going to be spending a lot of time with them, so you want somebody you're compatible with and who you feel gets what you're wanting. So I cater and apply what my skills are to what individual needs are of the homeowner or the builder or the client. Some people want me just to tell them from my conversations with them, this is what you need to do. Or there's other people who say, I want three choices, don't give me any more than that. And there are other people who want to be involved with more than that. They want to be there when I'm picking the fabrics and all those things. I get to know them and how they live, what they like, and I try to bring that out in their house because it's where they're going to live and they have to love it. She kind of came in in the beginning with pictures and, and books and items, catalogs of things, and, and she said, just show me some things you like in here so I can get to know what your style is and, and what things appeal to you. Just knowing that I've been through it a zillion times helps people realize that, okay, she's not going to let us make a mistake. It's never the end of the world. It's, it's always fixable and always doable. So that's kind of my attitude. Nothing's that stressful. I don't want them to have any regrets. I want them to walk in and love it and feel at home and see the beauty of it. That's just a really good feeling to know that I've accomplished what they want.